about three months ago, my best friend Greg was killed by drinking and driving. It's the kind of thing that you don't think will happen to someone you know, but it happened to Greg, and it could happen to you too. Greg was a great guy. He never really drank that much, but the night of the last party, something got into him, and he was really putting them away. I can't understand what happened. I don't know what the trouble was, but, but something must have been eaten at him that night. For some reason that night he wanted to leave early. I really don't know why. It, it seemed like he was having fun. Hey, what are you doing? I'm down with my sister for a ride home. You don't need a ride home. Don't let me wait for a ride home. You big baby. I'm not a big baby. I'm drunk. It's only five miles. Where are your keys? They're with Johnny up front. I checked him in. He won't let me have them back because I'm drunk. Get your keys for you, bud. No problem. Sweet. Hey, buddy for life, huh? Should I stay or should I go? <laughs> Craig, found the keys. Nice catch. Home free, dude. We tried to stop him that night, but it was no use. Maybe we should have tried harder. Uh, are you sure this guy can drive? Of course he can drive. He can handle his liquor. How he knows what he's doing. Put up on Should I go now? Greg had everything going for him. Looks, talent, great bunch of friends, but that's all gone now because of booze. We did our part to help him, but I guess that just wasn't enough. Okay, now you be careful and take the back roads on the way home. There could be cops. Oh, no. You got a dead battery. Oh, uh, thank God. That's okay. We can jump it. Woo! I even checked your oil for you. You're ready to roll. Oh, don't try. Greg was my best friend. I'm gonna miss him. It's so depressing. I need a beer. <laughs> <laughs>